Hi, I'm Tom Schwedhelm, the mayor of the city of Santa Rosa. As the coronavirus situation continues to evolve in our community, I want to reassure all of you that the health of our residents and visitors remains the top priority. Santa Rosa continues to take aggressive action to slow the spread of the virus, safeguard our public health system, protect those most at risk of getting very sick, and provide essential services to our residents. Effective Tuesday, March 17th, the City of Santa Rosa will transition to providing only essential city services. This means that the City will reduce public-facing interactions to slow the spread of the coronavirus and protect the health of our citizens and our employees providing essential services. The decision to adjust services was made in light of the recent recommendations provided by our Governor, State Health Officials, and the Sonoma County Public Health Officer. That combined with the recent suspension of on-site classes for most Santa Rosa school districts in Sonoma County's confirmed cases of the coronavirus, which were spread through community transmission. The essential public-facing city services that will remain in operation include, our police and fire will continue to respond to life safety and emergency incidents in the community. Your water and wastewater service will not be impacted. And please remember, your tap water is safe to drink. It is not necessary to buy bottled water. City bus and paratransit drivers will continue to provide this critical service to our residents. Fire, building and engineering permitting, as well as entitlement services will be provided on a limited basis, but will focus on those permits with life safety or regulatory needs. All other public facing city services are suspended through April 5th. During this time, the city will continue to evaluate services and may make adjustments to bring additional services back online, if feasible to do so with social distancing measures in place. As you may be aware, state health officials have recommended the suspension of most public gatherings, self-isolation for people over the age of 65 and or individuals with underlying health conditions, the closure of bars, brew pubs, and wineries, and capacity reductions and social distancing measures for restaurants. I understand that these can be stressful, upsetting times, and many in our community are feeling anxious. Important events and gatherings have been postponed. Work, school, and many of our everyday activities are upended. We must remember that we are all in this together. It will take everyone's help to slow the spread of the virus and to be vigilant in taking precautions to protect our most vulnerable residents. You can help by avoiding public gatherings and close contact in public settings, such as handshaking and hugging. The City of Santa Rosa is taking a common sense approach to the situation. As a community, we need to care for each other and protect our emotional health. If you are healthy, check on family, friends and neighbors that may be in self-isolation. See if they need help filling prescriptions or picking up groceries. And I know you have heard it over and over, but it must be repeated often. Please strictly follow everyday preventative behaviors such as frequently washing your hands, staying home if you are sick, and living in contact with those who are sick. There are many official resources available online to provide you with information regarding the coronavirus. You can find those resources at srcity.org forward slash prevent the spread. I encourage you to follow the City of Santa Rosa on Facebook and Twitter for updates. Although we may not be able to get together in groups, we can practice social distancing and stay in touch by phone or through social media. Let's spend time together with our family or a small group. Get outdoors and exercise and breathe fresh air. This is the time for neighbors to help neighbors. As a community, we can get through this together. Thank you.